Oh, hey, everybody. How you doing? I just watched the forum online of the 2022 Oakland mayor election debate that uh, was produced by uh, 21 different, 27 different Oakland groups, some media, some community groups, hodgepodge. Uh, Hilda at Laney College, perhaps you attended. I'm just giving you my preliminary impressions. Anyone running who's an outsider scored by looking at the comments on Facebook much better than the incumbent. Than the anyone who's an outsider scored much better than the incumbents by far. If you're an incumbent, doesn't matter who you are, you got a gigantic problem. I mean, huge. Of the outsiders, I would say in no particular order that Seneca, Ignacio, and Alyssa, Victory, fared the best of the outsiders. There were a couple of people that confused Ignacio with the current District 5 council member for, you know, a bit until they were reminded, hey, this isn't no Gaio. And then they would say, yeah, and Janelle Harris was like, yeah, this is not a little guy. This guy's an outsider. And then they would pay attention to what Ignacio said and write, oh, that's a good point or that's a good idea. I'm just giving you the preliminaries. I'll give you the details later. But the overarching message here is if you're an incumbent, it doesn't matter if you're Treva Reed of District 7 or Lauren Taylor of District 6 or Shang Tao of District 4, uh, you've got a problem. And the problem is that the very condition of Oakland, the crime rate, the problems with just obtaining basic service help, the feeling, the constant feeling of being under siege that many have has Put, put a pall, a dark cloud over this entire election season. And the closer we get to November, the darker it's going to get. That darkness reflects the attitudes of Oakland voters when they begin to think about what the current council has not done and what needs to be done. The people responding to a person are extremely upset with Oakland Mayor Libby Schaff and have expressed some extreme feelings regarding her performance as mayor. And when I say extreme, I mean in terms of language, in terms of energy, in terms of veracity. They're pretty upset, okay? This is pretty upset. So Libby's gotta work on her legacy. That, that's a separate conversation. This is the worst time I have ever seen in my history with the city of Oakland and particularly my history covering it as a media person to be an incumbent, okay? It, it, it's Someone is going to have to pull out a miracle. Now, the good news is if you're a challenger and in particular, if you are Ignacio or Seneca or Alicia, you've got a great chance. Subscribe to Zenny62 and bookmark oaklandnewsnowblog.com.